so that's a very common question and one that's often difficult to provide a solid answer to other than it depends. I think a good answer is it's often better to get an A in an AP class or honors class, but we all know that it isn't always possible. So here's a good way to look at that question. Colleges and employers or scholarship organizations want to see students take appropriately rigorous course loads and do well in those classes. One reason why a GPA is weighted in an AP level course is because of this exact question. Knowing the coursework is more difficult than students who normally may have gotten an A, maybe got a B instead, we want to honor that choice to challenge yourself. Colleges also notice that you may have taken a more rigorous option and will also recognize that effort in their process. This is called your strength of schedule and they pay close attention to it. Based on the classes that are available at your high school, did you take the easiest, the hardest, the most appropriate load available to you? And if so, how did you do in that context? If I had to give a hard answer to this question, I would err on the side of challenging yourself in the harder class and potentially getting a B then focusing on keeping the A. If you get into the D or C range, that's a whole different question and it could be worth an in-person conversation with your school counselor.